So you might be in a situation where for some reason you are not being able to see any One UI updates or Samsung updates on your Samsung Galaxy phone. Now, a main reason why this ends up happening is usually because your specific phone may not even have an update available. But the way you can check is by scrolling through all the way down, clicking on software update down here, clicking on download and install, and you should be able to see an update available and or an update already downloading on your device. Now, if you are not able to see this update, it means one of two things. One, you're not connected to internet. Two, your update is not available for your phone. And sometimes three, your update just may not be available for your phone right now. So right now with the One UI, especially with the One UI 5, my Galaxy S22 is able to see that update, but both my Galaxy S21 and my S20 so far are not able to see the update, even though other people have already been able to see it. So the reason why that you know, ends up happening, like I mentioned before, is because one, the S22 is the latest phone. So if you have the latest phone, make sure it's available for your region and your carrier. If you have an unlocked carrier using AT&T or something, you might want to research if it's available for your carrier. If so, again, click on your download and install button. If it's still not showing up, just go ahead and close out of all your applications. You can restart your phone too. Go back into your settings, scroll all the way down, click on software update, download and install, and seeing if it's available again. You might just want to keep trying, but eventually it should show up. Now, another thing that you can try doing is actually going through and checking online and seeing if your phone is even available on that software update. So this is another very common thing. You may own a Galaxy S9 and you might be looking for the latest update. Well, you won't be able to get One UI 5 on that phone, but you should still be able to click here, click download and install. And maybe, just maybe, you don't see that update, but you see another update. The way Samsung updates work is you have to install all the updates in order. So you may just have to go ahead and download and install the latest update and then go through and download and install. Like you have to keep going back to software update, download and install, and you have to keep doing the same thing over and over again. It can be a little annoying, but if you want the latest update, that's pretty much all you can do. So those are pretty much the main ways to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly with everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.